Hello everybody and welcome back to Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network 3 Blue Version! I'm your host, Scope, and we're gonna kick some booty. That's right, it's now the dumbed down, censored version. Yes, I'm going to try to keep my language pretty pretty clean from now on. I, you know, I just gotta appeal to a uh, better part of my audience. Anyways, in the last episode we made it to this little secret part of the hospital comp to fight the ranked number 9 Navi. Yes, he's standing right there, believe it or not, because this is where science gives life. Yeah, and if you actually come over here in the regular hospital comp, you'll see this guy over there, and he's looking here like, and he'll say something like, who is that guy over there, blah, blah, blah. So that's how you'll know. So let's talk to him. You're the rank, you're the net. Okay, let's, let's get my speech patterns correct before I speak. You're the Navi ranked number nine? That would be me. Wow, who, may I ask, are you? I'm ranked number ten. I'm Mega Man. So you've come to battle me, then. Actually, I'm just trying to find a Navi called S. S. Do you have any idea just how frightening the Navi that it is? <sighs> Navi is that you seek? I've heard a little about that. Still, I have to meet him. If you have any information, would you mind sharing it with me? All I know is that if you want to meet him, the only way is increasing your rank. If you do that, you'll bump into him eventually. So, in order to increase my rank, you will have to battle me. Well, if that's how we... it's gotta be. Let's fight. Just kidding. I'll give you my rank. What?! Come on, what? You... Uh, how the hell are you ranked number 9, buddy, if you're just gonna be giving away your ranks? What? My rank? I'll give it to you. To be honest, I'm tired of this whole ranking system. I started out, like everyone, battling my way to the top. But I've grown tired of fighting all the navvies below me. They come to challenge me day in and day out. Is it really okay? Don't make me repeat myself. Here, take it. And we get ranked 9. Now you're ranked number 9. Thank you. You can find the Navi ranked number 8. Hmm, let's see. In Red New 3. Yeah, that's it. Well, that's all I know. The hint to find number 8 is Red New 3? Um, I'll try finding him, thanks. Good luck, just try not to wind up dead. Alright, and just like that we get ranked number 9. Uh, I guess I can see what this guy is saying. Oh, no, we don't want to jack out, actually. I can see what this guy's saying, though. I mean, pretty much his, he's just living life now, and people are going to come challenge him non-stop. You know, it's like being a champion. It's like being like a champion in boxing, the heavyweight champion. People are just going to constantly be working to fight you day in and day out. It's never a resting situation. So I guess that makes sense. Anyway, you don't want to jack out here. What we want to do actually is head back to Beach 1. Because the hint was Red New 3. So pretty much if you switch that, if you read that backwards, it's 3 under. 3 under. So what that means is under net 3 pretty much. Under 3 under net 3. So, uh, not that hard to figure out, but yeah, so as we all know, fastest way to the under net is not this way. We want to, yeah, well, I guess we have to go this way, but you know, it's really not that bad with uh, no battles, no encounters. Uh, this might be some Zenny. I want to pick it up real quick. Oh, recover ADJ. That's not too bad. Yeah, yeah, okay, so we want to head to the Undernet. So Under 3, pretty much, where the area, the same place where we fought uh, Flam Man, that's where we're going to want to be heading. So it's quite a trek, but let's head there. At least we know the way now, so it shouldn't take too long. Uh, what's it called? Um, sneak Run's not going to do us any good here, so we're going to be finding some battles. Yay! I'll try to show the new battles off, I mean, whatever. So which way do we head here? Oh yeah, we head this way. So that little square right there, that's where we got to the bug frag trader. That's where he's at. And we're going to be doing something about those squares too. Those security cubes here. Okay, we're going to be doing something about those security cubes pretty soon. That's that's a side quest, but don't worry about it. We'll be doing it. Alright, so we head back to under one. Swoop or, come on, swoop around to under two. Nothing much to say here. We're ranking number nine, as you can see, just in case you forgot. What do we got here? Please, not a virus. Son of a bitch. Yeah, I'm still failing to get bug frags. It's not working out. I do need to get 30, though. That would be wonderful. Uh, maybe I'll head back to the armory. That wouldn't take that long to get it there. So are we in under 3 now? Oh, sweet. We are. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we want to get to uh, pretty much exactly the place where we fought Flam Man. That's where we want to go. So uh, let's head there. Okie dokie. <laughs> Did I just say okie dokie? Oh, all right. Wonderful. So yeah, battle... Uh, whatever. Okay, we got one Brug Frag. We're doing okay. Sweet. So let's save right here. Uh, yeah. 
So the guy should be up here. Here he is. And look, the ground's still tore up over here. So let's talk to him. Grr, I'm ranked number eight. You know, I think I've seen this Navi somewhere before. Grr, I remember you well. Your battle cry jogged my memory. Grr. How can this be? We beat that guy. Take this. Time to pay you back for the other day. Grr. Who is this guy that Mega Man knows? Oh yeah, you got it right. It's Beast Man, but this time he's new, improved, and he's back for revenge. Beast Man Beta. So yeah, let's fight Beast Man Beta. It's time for revenge. And this guy is crazy better than he was last time. Be careful, please. Please be careful, unless you want to die. So let's do it. Let's start off with an Invis. And look, this guy's going to go straight for just crazy attacks. But believe it or not, Beast Man is ranked number 8, so... Uh, it's him versus us. Oh, damn it, how did I miss that? Alright, so we're not invisible anymore, be careful. Yes. And we get just this great battle music again. It's really hard for me to talk over it because it's just so good. Right, we can hit him, right? If Roll can hover. Yeah, okay, great, wonderful. Yeah, and we don't have, once again, we don't have to worry about uh, wasting chips either because... Oh, shit. Because we've got Folder back now, so that's wonderful. Oh, damn, I, I just can't move quick enough on this controller. Oh, I know that's an excuse, but... Damn. Alright, let's see if we can lava stage this fool, get some good damage in here and there. Okay, well that didn't work out too well. Area grab for extra... Oh, he's paused. That didn't do anything. So yeah, and as you can see, Beastman is just crazy quick, and he's going to still be doing all those crazy moves we knew him to do before, so... Uh, he's, he's no joke this time. Seriously, he's not. If you're not very good, you're, you're going to die. Oh, yeah, there he goes with that crazy move again. Oh, my God, I'm dodging it like a... Oh, I was dodging it like a pro, too. And look how many times he does it, though. It's ridiculous. Oh, I had you. Luckily, our lava stage is getting some good hits in there. All right, let's use folder back. I'm done with... Or, you know, one thing you can do, too, is if you have any good chips with you, you can use those and then use folder back. So I'm going to set up a little meteor right here. Get some folder back going. Alright, let's, uh, let's heal up, because, well, no, we're fine, because we can just do this. Get him! Meteor his face! Oh my god, he's done already? Weak sauce! Alright, he's only got 250, we can get this guy. Yeah, 900 HP's a lot, especially for Beast Man, because... I, I don't know. He does, he does attack a lot, but he doesn't do as much damage as a lot of the enemies in this part of the game, so don't worry. Yeah, and, and the good thing, too, is when he goes back on your squares, when he goes back to hit your... Let me try to rephrase this. When he goes and warps on your squares to try and hit you, uh, if he hits those lava stage squares as well, it'll still hurt him. So pretty much he's taking damage from every square on the frickin' map. It's a little crazy. It sucks to be him is all I'm saying. You guys can probably hear my buttons clanking and clicking all over the place. All right, guy, you're whipping my ass, and I'm getting sick of it. Oh my god, how did I... There we go. That should have killed you. I would love to, like, uh... I would love to, uh, what do you call it? Uh, counter him to get 10 bug frags, but it's not gonna happen. But he is dead. He almost took us out, but we got him. You die forever, Beast Man! Beast Man, what's the W3 doing in the rankings? Grr. You seem to have a very bad habit of getting in our way. Beastman, jack out. Once we get a hold of Alpha, we'll have nothing to fear for the, from the Forbidden Program. As much as I hate fleeing from an enemy, I will do so if it's for a strategic advantage. Grrr. Alright, and there he goes. Wait! Lan, it looks like the W3s also after that program. So they also know about the Forbidden Program. Beastman got away. We're without any leads all over again. Land, something's on the floor where Beastman was. Huh, look what he dropped. And we get rank number 8. Now we just need to find out where rank number 7 is. Oh, who's this guy? You're a pretty tough kid to beat that beast that got me. Who are you? Me? I am. I mean, I was number 8. That beast thing got to me. Hey, but you're not one of those guys in the cloak. You're just an easy little guy. So I'm a nobody now. Thanks for making quick work of my enemy. In return, I'll tell you, I'll tell you the hint to find number 7. Really? Head of learning. That's the clue to find number seven. Good luck. Thanks a lot. Now's my chance. Give me back my rank. What? 
Yeah, of course, this guy's going to want his rank back after just losing it. So, well, here we go. Uh, so here we got a Spiky, Spiky 2, and Fishy Omega. We haven't seen him yet. He's, like, blue-tinted, but these guys are just... They were already fast. Now they're just stupidly fast. So what I like to do in battles like these is just turn invisible on so that you're good. And then just throw attacks, like, just randomly. And <laughs> look, you end up killing hella people that way. It's wonderful. Look at how fast that guy is. I do... Oh my god, it's stupid, and I'm about to die? Well, luckily, so is he. Ah, 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 ah. Let's see if we can get a counter out of this. Oh, nope. I had to wait till his little booster comes on. It look like... Looks like I was too fast. Ah, that'll work anyway. Oh, you don't even get chips for it anyway. No! Sorry, buddy. No rank for you. Peace! That was a little too close. You can't really can't let your guard down for a second in the internet. Yep, let's go find rank number seven. The clue was head of learning. Alright, so we want to get out of here now. Uh, yeah. So pretty much head of learning, think about it. The only learning place in this game really is the school. So the head of learning would be... Who's the head of the school, people? Head of learning. You got it. It's the principal. So... Where is the principal's cyber or net uh, counterpart on the principal PC where we fought Flashman? That's right. So that's where uh, the rank number seven Navi is going to be. It looks like we're moving up the ranks pretty quickly now. It's taking a while. Yeah, it takes quite a while just to get like rank number 10. And then you start getting them and it's like, oh, this is pretty fast. And uh, don't worry, it gets a lot faster too. So let's save over here just in case. I, I really don't remember this part, but so, you know, we can be safe. Alright, so let's jack into his PC, his pussy. Right, remember way back in the beginning episodes when we were over here using the umbrella to deflect Flashman's crap? Ah, oh, good days, good days. Alright, so we can run safely through here with Sneak Run. And uh, make it to the other part of Principal's PC. Principal's PC 2! Okay, so thankfully this place is small, so... Oh, okay. Oh, <laughs> what was that guy talking about? Thankfully, this place is small, so we should be able to find the guy, no problem. He wasn't over here where Flashman was, so... He's gotta be in a different part. Look at this big red statue. Okay. Where are you, man? Up oh, here he is. Okay, so we're back to the cloaked guys. Let's save. <clears throat> then let's fight this guy. How well you managed to get here. I'm ranked 7. Those who are ranked are duty-bound to take any challenge. You may have made it this far, but success is more than power. Real strength is driven by intelligence. So, let me now offer you a quest. If you can find what I may ask, you will get my rank as well. What should we do, Lan? There's no question. Take him on. Get him to give us the quest, quickly. You are a forceful operator. Prepare to receive your quest. One of many birds. Go now and find it. One of many birds? That's gonna be tough. Let's go, Lan. Okay, one of many birds. Well, this is pretty tough. Uh, this quest is kind of annoying because, yes, it's not just stuff in the net. You gotta jack out and go all over the world and look for crap again. Thankfully, I am highly intelligent. Well, not really. I just kind of know about game facts. So, yeah, other people are highly intelligent, and I feed off their knowledge to give you the information you quickly need so that we don't have to wander around aimlessly, not knowing what to do like sometimes we do anyway. So, one of many birds, I don't know how you're ever supposed to know this. I, a lot of these things in this game, I don't know how you're supposed to know without looking at a walkthrough, but I guess, I don't know. Anyways, one of many birds, you're going to want to go to the beach, more specifically, the hospital. And then go to the second floor, yeah. I still don't know what's going on here in this hospital with all these, uh, all these pigs. Oh, what's Anyway, one of many birds, basically what it's talking about is, is it this room or the other room? Oh yeah, here it is, this little, it looks like a coat on the wall to me, but I guess these are origami birds hanging on the wall. So you talk to this and he's like, one of many birds, could this be it? And we get the origami, so yeah, that's it. Not only is it in a ridiculous place that makes no sense way out of the way, but it doesn't even look like what it's supposed to look like. It looks like a freaking really bad coat. How are you supposed to know that? I even knew what to look for and I barely knew that that was there. So yeah, that's just... 
one of the more ridiculous parts of the game. And the, the guy said, you know, a good operator is one of intelligence or whatever. How does that take intelligence? That just takes luck or, you know, what do you call it? Computer savviness to be able to go find a walkthrough and figure out what you're supposed to do. That's ridiculous. I think we have to do more for this guy, too. I don't think this is the only part of the quest, sadly. Yeah, there's there's probably more. All right, let's jack back in. Thankfully, it's not too hard to get to this guy. Because the principal's PC is now walking the park, whereas before this was like, oh man, this cool new internet area, wow. Yeah, we, we've come a long way. We're strong, we're, we're good, we're ranked number eight. About to be number seven, because we don't even got to fight this guy. So it's gonna be good, it's all, it's all good. All right, can we get there any day? Yes, we can. All right, buddy. Got it. So you got so you got it right. Very well. I will award you the seventh rank. Oh, sweet. And we get rank seven. Yeah. Um, could you tell me the clue to find the next Navi? Yes, the clue. Hmm. What was it again? I can't recall. What do you mean you can't recall? Try a little harder. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Great persuasion, Mega Man. Shut up. If I forget, I forget. End of story. You don't like it? Give me back my rank. I guess I'll just have to search on my own. Hmm. You youngsters have got it too easy anyhow. Oh boy. Mega Man's like, yeah, one of these guys. We got mail. Oh, we get to check it ourselves this time. It's from Shod. Looks like an under that ranked Navi has posted on the ACDC Square BBS. It may be a trap, so be careful. Alright, so pretty much we got... Wait, did that say ACDC Square? Yeah, ACDC Square. Okay, so... We need to head to ACDC Square! Yay! Because uh, an underranked Navi, an underranked Navi has posted on there. So either it's a trap or it's the ranked number six Navi, hopefully. So yeah, we're just moving on up now. I don't think I have any battles to edit out in this episode. Oh no! And I can't remember who has the shortcut to the ACDC Square. Luckily, we have written log of all our. Uh, what do you call it? Okay, the eye has it. See, so having all your emails does come in handy. You can just run through them and check who's got the shortcuts. So let's jack into Yai's PC, so we can go straight to the undersquare. Or not the undersquare. ACDC square. Yeah, I haven't been here in a while. All oh, these duckies, 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 duckies. Do 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 we're so close to the end of the game, it's gonna be fun. The end of the game is really fun. This is this is where it starts to get good. Alright, so here's the BBS over here, let's check it out. Oh wait, this is the battle BBS. This is not what we want, right? Is it? No, 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 no. We just want the chat BBS, right? Do they have one of those here? Okay, yeah, I was just making sure, buddy. Just making sure. Well, maybe it is. Let's let's click on it. Uh, yeah, doesn't look like it. Wow, okay, well. Dude, why are we in Scilab Square? What the hell? Didn't... Oh, well, that makes a lot of sense. Frickin' Yai said she had a shortcut. I can't believe... Oh, I can't believe... <laughs> wow. That's what I get for speeding through the text, viewers. Learn your lesson. Learn from me. Learn from me. <laughs> what? That uh, was the stupidest thing display I've ever... Aw, oh, crap. Oh, yeah, because he moved. Wow, that's even worse. Okay, looks like we're just going to have to go the old-fashioned way, guys. This is embarrassing. Come on, man. Hurry it up. I wasted time, so we got to hurry. Run! Oh, back in ACDC. We haven't been... Oh, yay! I get to show this off now, too. I'm running across all these accidentally. Isn't that wonderful? Okay, we got another W3ID here. But sadly, I can't pick up the prize because we need an unlocker. Yeah, and I don't have it. So, well, we opened the door. I've got to make a mental note to uh, come back here and get that. Whatever it is. Or I could just put in... I could put in an annotation what it is. And maybe it's not important that I need to get it. And that will save quite a bit of time. Oh, we got a bug frag trader over there. Does that guy have HP memories? I don't think so. Not worth checking out, honestly. It's funny how all these side story navvies from like jobs and stuff just stay there. They never leave. It's kind of cool. 
900 any. All right, what are we at? 11 Ford. Cool, almost enough to buy the ones from Beach Square. I really want to get that out of the way. I mean, we're almost at the end of the game. Come on. Come on. Come on. What about here, ACDC Square? Sweet. Uh, yeah. Okay, so where's the BBS? It's up here, isn't it? Here we go. Yeah, that's so sad. No, we don't. We don't want the battle BBS. We want the chat BBS. All right, looks like a new message. So let's read this one that says no name. I'm just an old lady who loves to gab. But have you heard? There's going to be a secret tournament in the internet. You can bet it'll be dangerous. Forgive my anonymity, but I don't want to wind up like that guy in Beach Square. Don't know what she's talking about. So what's this one say? Yet another fool dare speaks of the internet. So be it. This will be overlooked. No, there are many warriors in the Undernet with unfathomable powers, including you-know-who. And I suppose they're speaking of at, um, S. The Navi S. Tread lightly. And what have we got here? I've heard of you. I'm ranked number three. Oh, ranked number three, Navi. What is he doing? Talking. Uh, we're only ranked number seven, buddy. If you want a piece of me, I'm at the bottom of the slope in Undernet 4. I'll be waiting, number seven. Alright, so he's speaking directly to us because we're number seven. Uh, so this would be a great chance to... Oh, I skipped that text. I'm sorry. It says, if we beat him, we'll instantly go up four ranks. Something tells me there's more to this than meets the eye. Still, we have to go. We don't have time to waste. Yeah, you're right. We've got to keep climbing the ladder. Come on, Mega Man. We're going to under four. Roger, roger. All right, sweet. So pretty much we have a chance to jump four ranks here, which we can't pass up, even if it happens to be a trap. So we're going to head to a new area we haven't visited yet, which is Undernet 4. We've only visited up to Undernet 3. So how do we get there, you may ask? Find out next time. I'll see you guys in the next episode of Let's Play Mega Man Battle Network 3 Blue Version. Goodbye, everybody, and have a great day.